Welcome to Ramco Systems. Material costing with Ramco On Demand ERP. Performing work order costing gets simple with Ramco On Demand ERP. The integrated system fetches transactional data pertaining to the work centers and work order departments to portray the work order cost. Ramco On Demand ERP follows actual cost of production. The cost of the item is made up of three distinct components, that is material cost, activity or process cost, and the additional costs, such as, overhead. The material cost of the item is taken from the item master, depending on the costing method chosen. So for, defining the item master, we need to go to inventory module, maintain item administration activity, and maintain item details. So the system calculates the cost of the item, such as, raw materials based on the costing method, specified in the item master. Once we have defined all the item masters along with their cost, the next step is to define the bill of material of the finished good. The same can be done by clicking on discrete production module, click on bill of material model, and click on maintain product structure. To create a bill of material, we need to define the quantity of raw materials which are needed to produce the finished goods. Once all the information is entered, we need to click on the submit button, and the bill of material is created in active status. In case there is some secondary byproduct, we can give the cost allocation between the finished good and the byproduct in the screen. For defining the process cost, we need to go to the discrete production module process model and resource master. While defining the resource, we need to decide that whether we need to define the process cost or not. If yes, we need to check on the checkbox for costing required and chose from the combo that whether we need to calculate the costing based on actual or standard time. Define the activity cost elements that will contribute to the process or routing cost. To do the same, we need to go to discrete production module, process model activity, maintain activity cost details. The relevant cost elements needs to be mapped to an activity. While defining an activity time type, you may map the relevant cost element. To define an activity, go to discrete production module process model and maintain activity screen. Map the created activity time type based on the type of activity performed. To perform costing, click on costing required. Once we have defined the activity master, we can define the process plan using hyperlink, maintain process plan. The process plan is a list of activity arranged in sequence to be performed to convert the raw materials to finished goods. Once the production department releases a work order, it is ready for execution. While releasing the work order for the item, the system automatically identifies the product structure and process plan for the same. While issuing stock, the relevant materials to be issued appears on the stock issue page of the inventory person. On reporting consumption of material at the shop floor, the material cost of the work order gets computed. The process plan has a set of activities and resources that perform the activities. The process cost is derived from time taken to execute each activity in the routing. As we adopt activity-based costing, the time reported during production from the shop floor at each activity should be captured. To report the actual time taken during production, we need to go to the report production screen. The costing department can also apportion utility bills and other overhead expenses. A percentage for each cost element can be given at the work order level based on company's costing policy and the allocation cost arrived. In case of byproducts getting produced in the production process, a part of the work order costs can be allocated to the byproducts as well. To obtain the production cost, go to View Order Details, which shows the actual and standard per unit. Detailed breakup of total cost into material, activity, and overheads cost can be viewed here. In case the management wants to look at a consolidated report, the same can be done using the material cost report. To launch this report, click on the discrete production module and click on the discrete production reports activity and click on the material cost report. Hence, on click of a button, the planned cost versus the actual cost of production for each work order can be monitored.
This gives the benefit to the management of closely viewing, if they are overshooting their previously predicted costs. Performing work order costing gets simple with Ramco On Demand. Contact us for a demo at cloudatramco.com or call us 1-800-500-1000.